Ta-da, okay, great. So hi, uh, I'm Fabian, uh, I work at Roly. Uh, Roly recently acquired uh, Juice, as some of you may know. Uh, and Juice used to be a one-man team uh, by a, call, a guy called Jules Storer. He's the mastermind, he's, you know, he's the great genius in our company. <laughs> he really is, he's, he's a great guy. Uh, he's very, very smart and he's, he put in, I think, over 10 years of his effort into this into this uh, framework and well it's it's caught some attention by the industry so uh, Roly bought this company and now uh, they can pay people like me uh, to to work uh, on, on juice um, so yeah this is about juice and and libpd and so I'm going to skip through some of the slides because Oliver already mentioned uh, Oliver and I we met at the sonar hack day in Barcelona uh, this June and it was a really really fun time. We had a, we had a great uh, time working on LibPD and Juice, uh, and that's sort of where the idea came from. It was very random, I think. It was just let's try, and yeah. So uh, just I don't want to make this sound at all like an advertisement. It shouldn't be. This shouldn't sound corporate. But the thing is, like uh, for, for people who don't know Juice, um, in, if you because it's built by one guy, if you go to the website, you might think, oh, what's this? Another one guy project. But it's it's not. It's not like another person's hobby project. It's really really big thing. Uh, I mean. These are only some, I think there are over 200 people using Juice. These are some of the big companies, many, many big companies I'm not allowed to talk about because we're not allowed to put their logo there. But uh, uh, yeah, it's, it's definitely the market leader in, any, in, in a cross-platform audio uh, plugin framework. And um, so this is what Juice does. So you program your audio application or your multimedia application or your audio plugin, you program it once. And you can use all of these great tools. You can use the audio toolbox, the MIDI toolbox, GUI toolbox, 2D, 3D networking, but a lot, lot, lot more. And yeah, that's all inside Juice. And Juice will allow you to export your application to an iOS app, to an application desktop app, to a Windows app, to a Linux app, to an Android app. And among the desktop platforms, you will also have all these plugin formats. Uh, and will just hopefully work out of, out of the box. Uh, so Juice is, is very, very powerful. It's very, very flexible. And I mean, many, many people ask me, so why C++? There's stuff like, there's so, so much easier programming language for beginners. Why, why have you chosen C++? And really the answer is you have to think that Juice is the, you know, Juice is used to program other programming languages like MaxMSP. MaxMSP is, is written in Juice. So, you know, if you're uh, a big company and want to make another programming language for other audio people, that's, you know, Juice has you covered even for these extreme cases. So really the only uh, programming language that offers this very, very professional and uh, this, this huge flexibility, is it's really only C++. Um, but C++ is not the easiest language to learn. Uh, but now with the new resources at Roly, hopefully we can sort of go from this picture to this picture, uh, that you can still use all of the old things, but for you know, people who are just starting, you can use libpd, uh, pure, your pure data patches, and, and use them with Juice. I mean, that's, that's, the, that's the goal. Um, what's missing, what's not working right now at all, I'm not sure, I, I haven't checked out the latest version, but the version I checked out last, is that um, uh, pure data is written in a way that you can only have one patch at one time open uh, and um, I mean there's some hacky ways around it but in a host environment where you have different plugin vendors you know some uh, company X makes plugin Y company Y makes plugin X uh, they all load their pure data patches that there's no crosstalk that not all of a sudden because the parameters has the same name uh, you know, bad things happen. <laughs> and right now, the last time I checked, if you open two different patches in the same DAW, the DAW just crashes. Um, and there are people who have worked around this. Actually, there were few, I looked up the history, and there were few times that people have tried this, and there are branches out there that offer this multiple independent instances in, in libpd. The problem is, is that libpd is, is uh, is you know, there's a lot of development going on in the PD by the community, and it branches, right? So somebody says, I'm going, I'm going to nail this, I'm going to fix this problem. So he works on his own branch, but no one uses it, and the PD evolves uh, without that. 
Uh, and so, you know, I think the only solution is to do this with the community, is to really, you know, talk to the LIPPD community, to get everyone's feedback. Uh, otherwise, it's just going to be another branch uh, somewhere. So we need the community support. And yeah, so thanks for, for Oliver for, for setting this up and, and for Carl, who's been doing some really, really great work on this. That's from my side.